Dugan, right circle, holding, shot, score! As they get the shot on, the turnaround off the rebound, and they score! Jack Dugan! The Dugan Shifty. scores! Jack Dugan! Impressive. That is the best way to describe Jack Dugan's sophomore campaign. The Rochester native recorded his 50th point against Merrimack on February 22nd, becoming the first Friar to reach this milestone since Devin Rask in 2001. So how does a Vegas Golden Knights draft pick end up in Friartown? I'd say the coaching staff first and uh, foremost. They've done a good job establishing kind of a winning culture here over the last seven or eight years, and Coach Lehman's been here, obviously for the whole time, and he's brought in great assistant coaches as well. The coaching staff is probably my biggest reason. Jack ended his first collegiate season with 39 points in a trip to the Frozen Four. And we went to Buffalo, which was, uh, it's about an hour away from where I'm from, so it was just a really cool experience overall. My whole family was able to come, and unfortunately, we didn't win the whole thing, but it was still nice to be there. Now, a year later, that feeling of falling short still motivates a hungry group of players. We fueled a lot of it. I think that me and a couple other guys, Tice, Mike, Princey, I think we all kind of felt that and uh, know how it feels to lose. I think that even though we have a young team, we came into the season kind of saying we know what it takes to get there and we know we have the team to get back there. So, Off the ice, Jack has grown into someone who represents something bigger than himself. I think what it means to be a Friar is to represent yourself in, in the program and the school and the best way you possibly can. And for the most part, as a team, we do a really good job of that. Coach Lehman harps on it. I think that for me personally, I've come a really long way in being able to realize that and maturing in that aspect. Increasing his offensive output in fewer games was not easy, but he says the process for his growth as a player was fairly simple. I think it's just more so of me being here for my second year. I think I have more confidence than I did last year. I think that anywhere you go, if you stay there for more than, than one year, you, you're definitely going to grow in uh, certain areas of the game. And I think that just this year, I don't, I don't think I approach it any differently. My mindset was the same. I, I knew what I wanted to do coming in. I knew what I had to do to help our team. And obviously, I'm still trying to do that now. Jack is a front runner for the Hobie Baker, a distinction awarded to the top college hockey player in the country something he is not focused on at the moment. As a team, we're just trying to win games. I mean, individual awards are always nice. It's always to be nice to be recognized for your play, but right now, I think the biggest thing for us is we need to win games, we need to get in the playoffs, or otherwise those things don't come along individually. You have to have team success first, and I think that helps. For Friars.com, I'm Mike DeMars.